How's it going, everybody? Today, we got a throwback box of 2010-2011 Panini Zenith. Always remember this product as a fun one to open up back in the day. I believe this is the only Dare to Tear product that has a rip card in it. Um, it's going to have a box topper pack that's going to have a jumbo card on it. And uh, you rip that open, it can have anything from just a normal base all the way to a National Treasures autograph. So that's definitely what makes these boxes exciting. We also are going to get 10 packs. I believe it's one to two autographs and one to two memorabilia per box. Um, but at the price, uh, it's not too big of a risk. A more of affordable product from Panini when it released and a pretty fun one to open up. I know there's Hall of Fame autographs as well as some top name rookie autographs. Uh, 10 11 was a pretty decent rookie crop. So some big names to chase and just overall a fun box to open up. So as always, we will be doing a giveaway on this video. We are actually going to be giving away the full box today. So everything that we pull in this card opening will be given away to one lucky winner. All you got to do to be entered into that giveaway is be subscribed to the channel. You got to drop subscribe, drop a like and drop a comment. All the rules for that giveaway will be in the description. Without further ado, let's get into the break. So here is the checklist of the product. As you can see, it is filled with the uh, notable names. Very good checklist. Chasing the Cup there is one of the bigger sets, as well as the Winter Warrior materials. And then we flip it on the back side. We can see here the checklist for the Dare to Tears. All whole crazy names. It makes you uh, contemplate ripping open the card. And then you can see the National Treasures autographs there. And the Don Rust Elite, just a, a, a variety of products in this one. So very cool throwback break for today. Here is our topper pack. It's going to have our rip card inside that. We're going to save it until the end. So we'll place it back here and uh, wait to open that one at the end. I actually did keep my one that I did from years ago. It's funny that I ended up getting my main man Crosby. From years ago, I still have it. It haunted me that I had to slice it open. I did end up getting a National Treasures autograph of Alexander Burmistrov. So there's a, a little look in case we don't get an autograph. That was the National Treasures auto that I got from years ago. And I still got the Crosby there. So uh, here's our 10 packs. We'll get into these and then we'll get into the box topper at the end. So here we go, pack number one. Okay, we're going to start off with a... Gifted Grinders, that is very cool. Brendan Morrow of the Stars with Shea Weber there. Gifted Grinders, and then right behind it, why not just pair the two? The jersey and the insert. <laughs> Too funny. Nice jersey, Brendan Morrow, that's going to be out of 299. And base. Pack number two. We've got a Ed Belfour Legends. They had some of the short print base, that's 140. Ed Belfour and the Sharks, wow. Throwback, all base. Pack number three, looks like we might have an autograph. Nope, it is a Meryl Lemieux Legends base. That is gonna be a high number of 125. Okay, what do we got here? It looks like a rookie. It's gonna be our first rookie maybe. No, it is gonna be a triple. This one is going to be a triple. I can barely read the names. <laughs> we got Daly, Jamie Ben, and Who's that on the far right? Is that Brad Richards? It is. Trevor Daly, Jamie Benn, and Brad Richards. Very hard to see the names there, but pretty cool finish to the card. There's a lot of unique cards like this that we don't see anymore. All right, looks like we got our first numbered red. Ovechkin, can we make it Ovechkin? No, it's not, but wow, that is filthy Daniel Alfredson. We will take that. Oh, not numbered. It's been a, quite a while since I've seen Daniel Alfredson. Red. Beautiful card there. And we've got a nice Henrik Lundqvist. What a finish to that card right there. Gorgeous in person. Base and base. All right. Looks like another Legends base. Now this one might be a rookie. Travis Moore. Travis Morin. Out of $9.99. Uh, gold here. Oh, it's going to be a private signings. I love these private signings. Just some unique designs and unique sets in this stuff that you miss in Panini. It's going to be Andy Greeny. Okay, not a, not a monster, but we will take it. Nice on-card Andy Greeny autograph. Clean design to the private signings. I wish, I wish Panini had some of this stuff in modern day. 
And then we had Derek Stefan and base. And our final pack, let's see what we finish off with. It is going to be a Minnesota Wild Winter Warriors jersey. Brent Burns, look at that. Brent Burns on the Wild. Nice way to finish it off. <laughs> Too funny. Before the grown beard came in, Brent Burns when he was a young buck. And there we have it. Let's finish with the Zenith topper card. Let's see if we can get a monster here. All right, it is going to be Steven Stamkos. Thankfully, not one that I don't mind ripping open. <laughs> They're facing the lease right now, so this one will be pretty easy to cut open. So let's see what we got inside it. Hoping for an autograph. Let's see. All right, there's our cut there. We'll pop this open. Do this as clean as we can. And let's slide it out. See. Card number 299, Kevin Shattenkirk. Oh, it is going to be an autograph out of 99. Wow, that is awesome. Elite Signatures, Kevin Shattenkirk out of 99. What a card to give away. Definitely worth opening up the Dare to Tear Rip card. They're not guaranteed to have autographs inside them, so we got pretty lucky today to get a good name and a rookie autograph out of 99. And to summarize the box as a whole, as always with the older Panini, you just get a bunch of hits, some unique cards uh, at affordable price range. It doesn't get uh, doesn't get much better. We got Andy Greeny here. He had a great career. Nice on-card slick signatures. Our two jerseys was Brent Burns. We had the Brendan Morrow gifted grinders, a nice insert there. And then a bunch of classic Zenith designs. We had the red Daniel Alfredson, the Henrik Lundqvist triple, and a few other inserts. So... Definitely the highlight of the break was the topper Dare to Tear rip card that we got the Shattenkirk rookie autograph in. And all the cards that we pulled today will be given away to one lucky winner. So all you got to do to be entered into that giveaway is follow the rules in the description. And we'll be back next week with another upload. Thanks for watching, guys.